I make this slaw specifically for my big hot cheese ripoff barbecue sandwich, which is coming in this little three-part series. Jalapeno slaw, the combo barbecue ripoff sandwich, and the big hot cheese ripoff barbecue sandwich. Basically, I'm ripping off the Pilot House, a barbecue staple in Southeast Missouri, right across from JC's Golf Course. Home of the 482 yard seven iron, mostly on the ground. I don't bother taking the seeds out of my jalapenos. Also, and this slightly pisses me off, there's very little heat in the seeds of a jalapeno. Most of the heat is in the veins. The acidity of the apple cider vinegar really works against the greasiness of the pork. This is a good slaw to serve with anything oily or good greasy, like ribs, pulled barbecue butt, brisket. You might call this contrast. This also goes great with fried fish or on a fried fish sandwich. Or on a hot dog or a bratwurst, believe it or not. I'm not a creamy slaw dressing guy. It always reminds me of church potlucks. I have to be in the mood for that sweet old lady. One time I dried habanero peppers. Holy smokes! This kind of makes you want to take an ice bath. It actually made my pee pee burn, like I had a little venereal disease or something. All we're going to do is bring this to an aggressive boil and then dump it on our slaw, cover it, and place it in the fridge overnight. This cooks the slaw and the jalapenos. This is pretty dang spicy, but the sugar in the slaw really mellows it out. It comes out perfecto every time. This slaw on its own on the side is a little bit hot, but I like it spicy.